So what do you think of the rainbow? It's powerful. You like it? Yeah. What do you like best about it? Um, a lot less work. It's not as hard. It's all that stuff out. <laughs> She's trying to film. But that's where that better be. Make sense? It's not hid. And the claws are in front of me. So what, uh, what would you use it on first? The bed. The bed? Why? I don't want to sleep in that. Where are you going to sleep tonight? The tub. Okay, did you see what I did? Did you see what I did when I said bed and she said bed and I smiled? And you smiled, which relaxed her. You think that was on purpose? Yeah. yeah. So where are you going to sleep tonight? No it's the only clean place in the house. Are you going to scrub it first? You probably feel like you're going to have to scrub everything, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. There's, you still do have some things that are clean. What did you like best about it? The versatility. The versatility of it. Uh, what did? Uh, what would you use it on first? Probably the car. You gonna take it out and clean your car? Okay, now I, you can take the stains out too. Coffee stains and stuff like that. It, it would be, you could literally detail your whole entire car with it, which is a neat deal. So basically, that's what you'd use it on first. You'd use it on the mattress. Okay, so Mrs. Jones, you would definitely use the rainbow, right? Yeah. Okay, now if you knew for sure that she would use it, would you help her get one? You'd use it too. You'd use it on the car. So you get used a lot around here. Okay. So basically, it's a real simple decision. You have a choice of breathing fresh, clean, water washed air or polluted air. Which do you prefer? Clean. This is everything it'll do for you. You'll get rid of all of this. We learned a lot about brooms today. They're nasty, aren't they? They don't work either. Let's take a look about a vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaners are all the same. The problem is, is the exhaust. Basically, it's putting all that bacteria and that unhealthy stuff back in the air. Well, the problem about it is, the leading allergist says, most vacuum cleaners pollute more than they clean. They just suck. So Dr. Zan says. I agree with him. But the problem is, because of the way the vacuum cleaners are built today, the dust is so small, it gets past the mucus in our throat, the hairs in our nose, and it goes straight to the soft tissue of our lungs. That's why allergies are worse today than they've ever been. We're certified by the Allergy uh, and Asthma Foundation. Independent laboratory it says the rainbow removes a significant amount of allergens from the carpet. What do you think? The allergen that is removed cannot escape and it stays in that basin. You will never have to breathe that again. It's going down the toilet. The difference between suction airflow, what's the difference? Bags clog up, filters clog up. That's why you've got this condition. That's why all the hard work you put in is for none. Okay, here's where a rainbow starts. 35 years from now, it's still going to be clean and the same. It never changes. You go out, well, it doesn't matter what you buy. They're going to lose their cleaning efficiency within the first five seconds or five minutes. And then it's going to gradually get worse, and it will never be the same. That's why you have this. Most advanced power nozzle on the market. There's not a surface it won't clean. It'll do everything that you, doesn't matter what you change to in the future, it'll take care of every kind of surface you can put on the floor. These are all the attachments you get with it. Oh, the AeroFresh bag? I already showed you that. Because we did it in the bedroom. We sucked down their pillows and cushions. Where are you? Wasn't that cool how it took the stains out? No more stains in the carpet? Okay, there's your mattress. Gonna have the EBGBs. jeebies That's why you wake up in the morning with a stuffed up nose. Once again, we're still certified by the Allergy Foundation. Okay, uh, warranty. 
All of the plastic is warranted for four years. Basically, here's how simple it is. We've you've been using plastic long enough. We know where the weak points are. We've already fixed them. If you're going to have a problem with the plastic, it's probably going to happen the first 90 days. Okay, now the motor and the computer module, it's warranted for eight years. Do you know what the warranty on yours is? Probably 90 days. Maybe a year. That's about all the longer. But we're going to take and warranty the motor eight years and the computer module. And if you're going to have any problem with it, it's going to happen. It's like a computer. When is the computer most likely going to go down in the first 90 days? Is something was wrong when it was made? Because after that, they don't go down. Okay, now how much does it cost? Well, let's see what it costs not to have one. How much does it cost to clean your home? Well, as close as I can tell, you're buying vacuum cleaners about every three years. And the one you've got, it looks like you're spending about three or four hundred dollars for it. So over a 15 year period, that means you're going to spend about fifteen hundred to two thousand dollars. You're spending a hundred and hundred and twenty dollars a year on it. Okay, now you've got paper bags, belts, and filters. You told me you don't replace the filters, so that's not even a cost. But that's why they don't clean, because they can't. And service and repair, have you ever had one serviced? Vacuum cleaners are throwaways now. You basically use them until you get tired of them, the way they smell, or you figure out they're not going to clean any better, so I better go find another one. Okay, air fresheners, room candles, and room deodorants. Well, we figured out you're spending about $60 a month on that. That's $700 a year. That's $7,000 over a 10-year period. And over a 15-year period, you're spending almost $15,000. Okay, air fresheners, can. Oh, we already done that. Perforcent carpet cleaning. How often are you doing that? About every six months. Uh, carpet replacement. Your average is about six years. So you're spending about four to $5,000 every six years getting new carpet. Guess what? You have no stains anymore. We've got all the filth out. You don't have to replace it. Okay, another thing you want to put in here is how about mattress replacement? See, if you don't have anything to clean a mattress, and mattress replacement's more than carpet replacement. Because we talked about that earlier. An average mattress, you're going to spend three, dollars $4,000. And they'll tell you that you're going to have to buy another one in eight years. But after six months, you've got the same thing. Just like you said, where am I going to sleep tonight? I, I'm going to tell you right now, the bathtub's not going to be comfortable. Especially if he gets in there with you. That's going to be a tight fit. <laughs> Mops, buckets, and other cleaning equipment. We've already figured out you're spending about $200 every six months because you buy every new one that comes out. So if you add all of that up, you've already bought a rainbow and paid for it. But the problem is you've never got, one, got it to clean. So over a course of a 15 year period, the costs of cleaning just stack up. For the price of a bottle of water a day, you can have a clean house. So how much is it? Let's take a look. The Rainbow Cleaning System is 3163. We have a 21 year service agreement. Let me explain how that works. After the warranty, up to 21 years, what we will do is we'll take care of the service part of it. And all you have to take care of is the part. Have you ever taken your car down to the dealership and say, I just need this part fixed? and they charge you five dollars for the part and it's three hundred dollars to put it in I wish I had that on my car too we're gonna to take care of the service part all you have to do is pay for the part and we're gonna do that for 21 years okay so that totals up at 3362 okay however if you can help me I can save you some money your price today will be 2765 total savings of 597 okay what we need to do is we need to take your old vacuum cleaner uh, you've already gave me some names. I've heard your phone over there beeping, so you've got a bunch of people. And I looked, you already had seven people that said, yes, they want you, they want one. They want a rain mate. And then you got to buy today. Okay, there's three good reasons to go ahead and get it. You already told me you like it. Have you seen enough need, or do I need to do some more cleaning? You've seen enough need? I don't need to do any more cleaning. I can. I got plenty more cloths. And I got another jug. 
but you also both of you you said you would use it on your car and you said you'd use it on the mattress before I you know tonight okay so we accept the following methods of payments we take personal checks we take credit card we take debit card cash we also have payment plans we have uh, plan A and B we have plan C and D you know what there's one thing I forgot what haven't I cleaned the grout I'll be right back. Let me go out and get my attachment.